Welcome to the World of Maps how-to videos. In this video we will be showing you how to take one of our editable PowerPoint maps and enlarge or reduce it. So let's get going. For this video we are going to be using one of our editable county state maps and this is the state of Maryland and by editable what that means is that each object in our maps are individual items and they can be colored, uh, changed, moved, uh, deleted or whatever you want to do um, I just selected them here. You can tell they're selected because you can see the little handles. And I can go to my formatting palette. Maybe I'll just change them to be orange, something like that. Very easy to do. Just click on them and change. Uh, the text is also fully editable. As you can see, I can just go right in here and change anything I want. What we're going to do is just work on one section of this map. This is the lower right-hand corner of the state of Maryland. And we're going to just select these items and then show you how to enlarge and reduce them. So there are two ways to select items in uh, PowerPoint. I can just click on them with my pointer, little mouse pointer, and you notice it's selected because of the handles. And if I hold down the shift key on my keyboard, I can now select multiple objects. So to enlarge or to reduce, the key is we need to group things together. So we would just go in here and select all of these items. If you have a lot of items, this might be kind of a, a pain to do. If you just have a few, it's easy. The other way to do it is just take your pointer, click off on the side somewhere, and just drag around. See how I've just dragged all the way around. Everything I want to select, I release my finger, I release the mouse button, and everything is selected. I can now go to my uh, draw menu and I am going to group them right here. There's group and now they've turned into one object. That's the key for enlarging or reducing is to group everything. So now that it's grouped I can copy it. So we'll just go to, oops, just go here and go copy. Okay, and I'm going to do this on a separate slide. So I've inserted a slide, a new slide. and Let's go to that. And now I'm going to just paste here we go, paste, and let's move it to the center of the, of the slide. And now I can just easily enlarge it. So what I like to do is use one of the corner handles, and my favorites are the opposite corners. So I'm just going to take my pointer, put it over one of the little handles. See these little handles are on the outside. Hold down the shift key to keep it proportional, and I can just drag this bigger. Notice that. Everything just moved right up. Now, what you'll notice is that the land enlarged, but the text did not. It went basically to the right place, but it didn't enlarge. So to do that, what we now do is just go to our formatting palette before we've ungrouped, and we'll just start bringing this up one point at a time. It's 10, there's 11. 11 is not too bad. Let's see what 12 looks like. 12 is pretty good. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is ungroup it. Ungroup right here. And now I can just move my text so it just makes it look a little bit better. And there you have it. Very easy to enlarge or reduce. If you want to reduce, just um, go in. And these ones got picked up from the previous, so we're just going to delete them. See how easily those things delete? And if I wanted to, I can easily just go in here and I can change the colors. Let's make that yellow. And we'll make this one blue. And simple as that, it's been enlarged. Very, very simple to do. So in this video lesson, today's video lesson, we learned how to enlarge or reduce a map. Simply group all the elements, bring it to a new slide, and just um, make it bigger or smaller. So very, very simple. Thank you for joining us today at the World of Maps and our editable PowerPoint maps for our PowerPoint presentations, uh, sales and marketing presentations of all kinds. They're royalty free, easy to customize. They download immediately. Uh, we have U.S. and states and Canada. We have world projections, globes, regions, uh, states, counties, and over 90 countries. So check them out, and we will talk to you next time. Bye-bye.